Eight minutes now before 8 o'clock, and a group of UPEI students hoping to raise money to plant trees by selling environmentally friendly coffee mugs. The group is called Enactus, UPEI. Enactus is an international movement that combines entrepreneurship and environmental awareness. Students compete at regional, national, and world competitions with projects that bring about change in their communities. The UPEI group has competed twice with their project called Treeternity. Island Morning's Nancy Russell first met up with the Enactus team in March as they prepared to launch their latest fundraiser. And as she tells us, the students have learned some real-life lessons along the way. Well, let me get your email and I'll send you some... It's yeah. mid-March and the team from Enactus UPEI is making its pitch to the manager at Kettle Black, a coffee shop in downtown Charlottetown. Are those the ones that you're buying? Well, they're going to be 16-ounce stainless steel coffee mugs. Uh, they're going to have our logo on them um, for the shop. Manager Sean Wall yeah, likes what he hears. I thought it was good. They had a lot of really good points. It's this kind of real-life business experience that has attracted these students to an actus. My name is Brandon Hingbotham. I'm a second-year business student at UPEI. I like going out, kind of creating projects, innovating and making an impact on people. And that's one of the great things about an actus is that you impact communities throughout Prince Edward Island. Hi, I'm Josh Mohan, second-year engineering student at UPEI. Well, an actus had originally reached out to me as a business student, and so I signed up. I dropped out of business because I didn't like it and I enrolled into engineering because that's what I really have a passion for. Since then I've realized that it is beneficial for an actus to have students from all different faculties across the university because we bring different traits to the table. I'm Ronnie McPhee, I'm a third year political science student at UPI. Uh, an actus stems from, uh, it's kind of a weird word, but it, uh, it stands for entrepreneurial action us, taking the, the first part of each word and creating an actus. The idea around an actus is uh, executing uh, different uh, projects in your community, taking uh, entrepreneurial business traits and, uh, and transforming them into like a social entrepreneur, just because it's not, not always about making money. The same goal. Uh, we're not here to make a profit, we're here to make a difference. So if something that we're doing can translate well into another part of the country, we will definitely take advantage of that and work well with another an actus groups at different universities across uh, Canada. Thanks a lot. We will talk to you soon. Today, the Enactus team has successfully pitched their reusable coffee mugs. They plan to use the money they raise from the sales of the mugs to plant trees with classes of elementary school students across the island. The group picked the former Plan B site as their target area to highlight their message of environmental sustainability. So this project is called Tree Eternity. So it's like eternity for trees. When we were presenting with the schools last fall, everything went great. We were able to present in 10 schools across the island with over 20 or 25 classrooms presented in, reaching over 1,000 students overall. So we were really humbled by the, those numbers. And well, our first approach was the provincial tree nursery. So we went there and had a few questions and meetings about them, about certain trees, got more educated on the tree aspect. We also then contacted the Department of Transportation and partnered up with them to have the Plan B site planted on. Uh, game plan, well, in this coming months is to establish the coffee mugs, make sure we start getting a revenue to put back for transportation with students. And then the springtime, we're looking at going out to the sites with the students to plant and providing more planning come the springtime. Fast forward to June. The Treeternity mugs are now available at four coffee shops around Charlottetown, and sales are going well. But the tree planting hasn't gone as planned. We had full intentions of going out with these classrooms in the springtime and, you know, taking the kids out and planting small seedlings at many various sites uh, across the island. But unfortunately, due to the tremendous winter that we experienced, none of the schools have any time to take the kids out because of the uh, short time frame they have to get in all the curriculum. And so we were quite disappointed with that, but we are hoping to be able to take some kids out in September. With the school trips on hold, the Enactus team switches its focus to raising more money for planting trees. We have what we're calling is our sapling campaign, and customers can go into various restaurants and they can speak with the barista and ask to purchase a sapling, and that's a minimum donation of a dollar that goes towards our project. 
and uh, for each dollar we, we receive from this campaign, it goes towards planting one tree. The group is also working on a new website where they will sell their Treeternity and Enactus UPEI merchandise, including coffee mugs, t-shirts, scarves and backpacks. Enactus also has a number of other community projects on the go, both on the UPEI campus and in schools. And they've got their eye on bringing Treeternity to competitions next year. <laughs> So far, the UPEI group has finished second at the regional level twice, and they competed nationally in Toronto this spring. Uh, we came runners-up in our division, and uh, we we're very happy with that result. It's an improvement on last year of us just winning a Spirit Award and Most Improved Team, whereas this year uh, we've taken the improvements that we obtained last year and actually uh, won an award. An Actus member, Ronnie McPhee, says the competitions keep the group motivated. You know, when we do projects like this, uh, we obviously the main focus is, you know, making a difference in the community, but it's also important for the students, a part of an Actus, to get, to get something back as well. So with these regional national competitions, it's an, an unbelievable experience. It's like, uh, you know, compared to the, the Canada Games or Olympics, it's, it's the, the enthusiasm of the students is incredible. What's it like for you seeing something go from you guys sitting around a table having an idea to seeing it happening. Back two years ago when Brandon and I started the project, we had no idea that we could get something going this big. And it, it's an incredible feeling, one I think everyone should experience, to be able to create a project, create something from nothing, and just watch it bloom as it grows and grows and grows. Josh Mohan says the group hopes the Treeternity mugs and sapling campaign will help grow their tree planting project. They'll be gearing up to take out student groups in September. The goal is to increase the level of participation in Treeternity to impress the judges the next time the UPEI group heads to competition in 2016. Thanks, Sean. Thanks, Sean. For Island Morning, I'm Nancy Russell oh, yeah. in Charlottetown. Um,